Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in Victoria 2, playing as Brazil. So right now on screen, you see, I've taken a little bit of infamy. This is where we left off last time, it's pretty close, but due to the comments, someone suggested I take out out state from Argentina, most notably Buenos Aires, but unfortunately, that is their capital, and that uh, allows them to get immigrants, which we don't want them to do. So instead, I'm going to take Argentinians at Trail Rios because they still have a port down here. So we really want to eliminate any way for Argentina to get immigrants. That's going to take a while for us. But anyways, we've got two-thirds of our population can read. 83% of the way there towards our justification. We're making quite a bit of money. We are 10th in the world, which is amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. And we're at 90%, so I am going to go ahead and raise my army abilities. Uh, I don't really probably need to raise that too much. But I will tax the capitalist a little bit more to help offset some of the costs. Oh, and that's quite a bit of cost. Which we probably can't really sustain that well. Something like that, maybe? 4%, 25%? <laughs> there you go. Lo ah, nice. Very good, very good, very good. So, I've already set my arms around and about. We already are making even more brigades right now. We got two more we can probably poop out. Uh, get one of these guys and grab an infantry, and we are ready and good to go to war with Argentina. Now I don't think I can take Buenos Aires because that was what someone suggested. So that is unfortunate, but we will take this little port of Entre Rios, which is still technically kind of owned by Paraguay. Now, these guys are allied with Peru. Obviously, I'm not really focusing on Peru first. What I'm really focusing on is Argentina, because their armies are going to be a little more difficult. They got 8 military score. We have 72. They have 6. We still have 72. And I don't want to pick a fight with Peru, because they're in you know, America's fear, and America can slap us down pretty easily. So, it is what it is. And actually, is that really the best place we can get stuff? So, Entre Rios is right here. Entre Rios, Entre Rios. What do they have? They got livestock there. Hmm. Do they have any special kind of RGOs instead that would be very profitable to take? Not so much, no. Not really, no. That really sucks. It's pretty much everything that we already have. Now, Chile looks like they got some precious metals. Some iron. Do I have any coal down there? I mean, there's coal. Where is that coal? It's right there. Yep. Oh, no, they do have some coal. Hmm. I need to get a Chile sometime. Would you like an alliance? Would you like to increase relations? But regardless, are our armies ready to go? No, we're going to give it one more month, and then we'll go to war. Yeah, yeah we got the war justification done, ready to go. And we look pretty darn good. We're going to go ahead and declare war. Entre Rios, just so that we can begin limiting their immigrants. We need a lot of score for that. Call in allies. Uh, Portugal will accept. Ecuador won't, but the UK will. Which, for me, that's okay. As long as... All we want to take is one tile in this war, which would be very, very important. Good. They refused. Good. Second alliance? No, that's what I thought. We'll keep increased relations for now. I doubt they have a big navy. If they do, well, we're kind of screwed for that. But whatever. Blockade them. They can't get any, any immigrants right now anyway, so that's good. Uh, just got to keep an eye on... Oh, Peru didn't join them. Nice. They're by themselves, which is okay. They assume leadership. Hopefully, we can get what we want out of this war. But I will go ahead, once this is done. I was thinking about doing more army stuff. Strategic deployment. Eh, we can do that. It's pretty cheap to do. I was thinking of doing commerce. More administrative efficiency as well as tax efficiency. I think that would be very, very... Oh, good. Oh, this unit is exiled. Oh. Colon. That'd be good. You guys come down here. You guys come up there. Rivadavia. We do need to start smashing some of their armies, but whatever. Wars happen to us. Well, duh. Makes sense. I could see you down in the capital. That'd be pretty good. Oh, Ecuador, sure. Uh, you know what? I'm going to raise that up quite a bit. That's fine. I really hate lowering my educational budget, but, you know, it's kind of a necessary thing to do right now. And we've got a couple rebels here and there. Hmm. You can go ahead and take those guys out. That'd be oh, well, actually, you're right here. You might be able to take them out by yourself. Yeah, they'll be able to take them, well, hopefully, by, oh, by themselves. Hopefully. Cool. Maybe come down there. Maybe you guys come over there. Oh, that's a lot of guys. Hey, Portugal, how you doing? Oh, they really death stuck that area. That's not good. 
Yeah, they'll be fine. Santo Tomas. Good. Very nice. I mean, they can try to siege me down as much as they want, but it, it's not going to happen, man. Get real. Now, where are they going next? Cologne. Very good. Good. I'm going to get down here so I can... Ooh, nope, the Portuguese left. That's not good. We don't like it when the Portuguese leave. Come on, Portuguese people. Help me out. Help me out. Oh, they got rebels here, too. What the heck? You're going nationalists. You guys will be fine. You got enough of that right there. That's good. And then come back down when you're here. Nice. All right, circulation doubles. Do not deny the rumors. Oh. So be it. It is a evil we must endure. All right, not bad, not bad. Wow, that is a lot of guys. It's, it's really not worth attacking that many guys right there. But I will go for the capital very soon. Oh, look, we got those guys there. Nice. Awesome. Um, since we're in war already, I'm going to grab some of this as well. Where are they headed to? Oh, that's not bad, yeah. Attract them into there. How many more days? October 6th. Come on, hold out. Nice. Now, ooh. What are you guys doing? Now, we are defending. They're just smashing the hell out of me. Holy crap. Hey, we won. I'm not sure how we won, but they're smashing the hell out of me, which wasn't very good. Get out of my way. Get out of my way, son. I can't even go to peace. Oh, that really hurt my war ability. Oof. Oh, we got more defense. That's good. Um, yeah, I'm gonna let the Brits do that. Yeah. Do we still have rebels? How the heck do we still have... Get rid of those guys. Come on. Yeah, let the British take care of this. I want to watch this battle, so... They're they lost 2,000, 4,000. Oh my goodness, they're losing... Yeah, this is a... This is a high... Ooh, high casualty war. My goodness. They immediately go this way. Wow. Thank God. Stay there. Hmm. Nice. Come on down here. Make yourselves a little stronger. That'd be great. Nice. Good. Using the Portuguese to our advantage. I love it. How's this war going so far? Let's see. 39%. Uh, very good. French Algeria. Okay. Mobilization size. Good. Some of these guys are exiled. Good. Junin. Juin. Nice. 70%. Almost 70%. Education. That's awesome. South and Oh! Hey! We won! We took it! We got it, my friends. Great. You guys do that as well. You guys stay there. And then you guys just kind of hang out and do that. Don't even do anything else. You guys lower this. By a lot. Lower this by a whole ton. Lower this by a whole ton as well. Lower that completely. Nice. Thank you. I love having great power allies that can do everything for us. Nice. And I want to do that early on just so that we can come back repeatedly to kill them off with my allies. Ah, oh, what a great strategy, my friends. Oh, Italy. Hello. France, you're below America. What happened? Oh, Japan is still there. I thought Japan left or something. And the great power status. Now, someone said I should continue trying to expand my colonies. Well, I'd like to, but it's really impossible to do so. We need the Dark Continent for tech. That's not tech. The Dark Continent. It's still not down here, which really sucks. Yeah, it's still not down here. 30% chance to discover it, though, so that's good. It is 1890, which is awesome. We need military logistics and steel steamers. Military logistics... Which is that one right there. So we're, we're, we're getting there. Oh, yep, we just discovered it. But I have a good feeling we probably won't be able to colonize anything. Which is quite unfortunate, my friends. Quite unfortunate. I don't think there's any islands nearby that I could even colonize. Uh, let's see. Civilization level. I mean, there's that. 
Ooh, political party now unavailable. Oh, good, we got rid of some of those older parties. We still got Palisto, which is amazing. I love it. Uh, naval map mode. Oh, actually, yeah, naval map mode. We can expand the navy air efforts. Naval dockyards around here, perhaps, maybe? Or we come back here and help out Brazil. Proper. Let's see, civilization. Recruitment. Colonial levels. Oh, uh, yeah, we really can't do very much of anything. Anything up here? No? Hmm. We just need a bigger naval base, or more naval base range. We just need more range, which I don't have. Quite unfortunate, I know. So, we won't get into Africa right now unless we take out, like, these smaller states, but even then, we kind of already taken out, so. Transvaal still there. Gaza. Allied with Neble. Where's Neble? Oh, you're right there. Neble. Oh, look! Reforms! I love reforms! Good healthcare? Ah, uh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Good healthcare is always a good thing. We are peace. We have... We're ranked 11. We have no immigrants. And neither does Argentina, which is okay. Colombia, got a couple of immigrants here and there. Good for them. But I don't care. Uh, Mossi? Portugal? Kingdom of France? I could go to war with these guys, probably, but... 10 infamy, potentially. Do they even have any good RGOs over there? No, just more cattle. We really don't need more cattle. Ooh, precious goods are right there in Transvaal, but I don't want to go to them. They're pretty developed. Right now, though, industry. Hot blasts. Hmm. Money-wise, we're doing okay. I don't think we need to do much more about that. High-pressure steam engine. Actually, grain factory, grain factory, cotton. Let's get some more railroads. Communist propaganda, crack it down. Just crack them. Crack them down, sons. Good. We expand. Oh, dye factory. Sounds very nice. This is looking pretty okay as well. Rubber found. Oh, we have some. Oh, rubber. San Ignacio. Now, we don't have a lot. But rubber might just be our saving grace. Wow. More Brazilians there. Awesome. Awesome. Amazonians are not accepting. Well, they're already kind of a core core culture. Oh, nice, this could come in handy. Oh, even more rubber. Yes, 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 yes. Can I build anything that uses rubber? Not, I don't think I can use anything yet that builds rubber, but that's extremely good. Auto Paraguay. What else? Ooh, that's not great. Sawmill. Go to expand the factory there. It costs us some serious money, but that's okay. Hmm. Projects. Uh, this probably isn't really worth it, just because we don't really have the RGOs for it. But, you know what? If we still have one, I think that's still pretty good to do. Ooh, right now. Administrative regions. Go ahead and do this. And do it from Sao Paulo. That'd be fine. You guys are... Well, do... Oh, uh-oh. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. We have a crisis. Transylvania de Nord. Oh, hungry. You're looking... You're actually not looking too bad. Austria looks like a giant mess. But, uh... Oh, they got rebels. The Russian Empire is backing Hungary. Oh. Hungary actually doesn't look too bad. Oh, why does Italy own that? Istrian? They don't even have Istria proper. Trieste. Oh, we might be a, a great war here. Which would be fine with me. I don't really care. That's good for us. But, uh... Hmm. Hmm. Infrastructure, anyone? Maybe a naval base? Oh, we can do stuff here too. Awesome. Railroads for everyone. Oh, I forgot this too. Oh, that's not good. Awesome. This could come in handy. One year draft while well, you yes. Oh, yeah. Even more school systems. Awesome. Yeah. Most definitely. And then maybe we'll make child, child labor illegal. Maybe. Ooh, awesome. Good. Make us that money. Anything else here? Ooh, we have... Yeah, I don't know if I can afford this stuff for them all to be closed. Go ahead and do that. It's going to cost us some money. So be it. Not bad. Expanding factories. More railroads. Yes, yes, yes. Explosives. It's good. Hot blasts. Great. Oh, yes. We can build more roads. I love it. I can't afford it, but whatever. Time is on our side. Sympathy strike. 
more socialism. Oh yeah, we don't want more socialism. Put that so put the socialists down. Oof. Hmm. Gaza. I'm really feeling like taking out Gaza. I think it's our time. Oh, and put you guys back at home. Put you in campus. Oh, yeah, some of those armies got hit really hard. Holy cow. Can I build any more? I can. That's really bad. Uh, that's a case. 113. Ah, uh, we can probably combine these guys. Oh, white piece. That's not bad. No great war this year yet, my friends. No great war yet. And we got plenty of this. Netherlands, Italy. Wow. A little bit of lag, whatever. Liquor production output. Very good. Good. Just put both of them at the same place there. It'll be fine. Good. So we have... Actually, that's not terrible. We could use at least one more army there. One more, like, guard or something. That's fine for now. How's the other armies looking? You guys are lacking. You need infantry. Oh, yeah, do that. That'd be good. Pretty Patagonian there. That's fine. Alright, so here's the problem that we've got to do. Let's see. Gaza, you are up next. So, obviously, if I get found out, then we'll see what happens. Yeah, Portugal's down there, too. Oh, Transvaal is taking out Orange. Oh, yes, more rubber, please. That's awesome. I love it. Uh, oh, let's go and save. Oh, 70% of our population can read. I think that's amazing. Good, good, good. Railroads down here. Eh, it's becoming more and more Brazilian, but I think it's better to do this first. This was a better naval base. Need to expand down here, but it's still pretty jungly. Oh my goodness, that's maybe a little bit too much. Good. You guys. So we need a horse and an artillery piece. We have our two guy coming horse. It's good, and you uh, five six. Well, you send over one artillery piece and a horse, I suppose as well. Santos performs. Hmm. I guess that's fine. Nice. You're gonna stay here at home, probably, or not. Yeah, you're not. You're gonna come over here. Oh, and I will see you in just a little bit. Alright, my friends, it's now 1891, August 25th, and we have our justification ready to go to war with Gaza. So we need to go to war by, like, the end of May, really the end of June, but the end of May would be a pretty safe bet. I am sending my army down here ish, somewhere. They're in the water. They should be coming to Madagascar, which I'm glad we set up Madagascar as that. Torching of the Summer Palace. Oh my goodness. Uh, that's probably not good to burn down. Ch I know. Wow, Japan. Wow. Um, this might have severe repercussions for the next 100 years, but you know what? I don't know. We'll see what happens. Totally won't ever turn communist. Ever. Are you guys here yet? Oh my goodness. Yeah, you take forever to get on a boat. Oof. So I want to get them on the boat, and then we'll raise like our army levels, our payment levels for them, their pay, pay grade, because people want to get paid. Oh, and we can also course some of this stuff. Great! Excellent! Excellent! They're slowly becoming more and more Brazilian. I love it. Uh, as it should be, my friends. As it should be. I want railroads first. Railroads first everywhere. So many railroads. Tons of railroads. Oh, we can't even do it there yet. Mm. Nice. Connect everyone together. Because that's what it's all about. Connecting each other with roads. Even though this is going to hurt my budget when I go to war, so. Let's lay it off a little bit. You guys finally arrived. Thank God. We probably only need one army. We'll see what happens, of course, but... Alright, now the budget's good. Sorry, I gotta tax you more. 
We should still be making a little bit of money, which is actually pretty darn awesome. So I can probably tax you guys a little bit less than what I just did. More iron output, which is great, even though we have no iron. And we get some more reforms. Great. Ooh, capital punishment. Uh, incarceration sounds like fun. Rehabilitation. Also, I did do uh, good school systems, so that's good. For child labor restricted. More poor savings. Less educational efficiency, but more child labor elite. More education for the children. Children, you must go to school and make your mom and dad happy. By going to school. The common man. Crack down on these radicals. Uh, yeah. Yeah, de definitely put them down. Definitely, definitely. Give me one more month, and we'll, then we'll go to war. Because now we're only 12th in the world, which is... Eh, it's okay. It's not great. Oh, wait. Who are you going to go to war with? Mor Danish war against Morocco. Hmm. Alright, we're almost there, and... Nice. Actually, help. they're a little more helpful, too. I don't think they have an army, which is... Oh, they're... Oh, no, 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 I need to get a war. I need to kill them off faster before the UK can. No, 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 get over there. Hurry, I know you got some really slow ships. Doesn't matter. Hurry up, get over there. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Might as well wait for the next month. Good, so we can lower infamy a little bit more, and let's go to war. We don't need any allies here. No, thank you. Go, go, go. Siege him down, siege him down. Okay, you're going to take forever to get over there. But I like the railroads that we're doing. Awesome. Bessemer stuff, yes, yes. I'll put, yes. Land, and just siege it down as fast as possible before the British really show up. Oh my goodness, they're showing up, they're showing up. No, 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 no. Oh, no elections, no one cares about elections. We get it, awesome. Now go over there first before the British do. Oh, no, 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 I think the Jamaicans showed up first. Ah, Jamaicans. God dang Jamaicans. They would not accept this. Hmm. Are they going to there first? Oh, they'll be there first. I'm not, I'm not going to waste my time going down there then. You guys, come to port. Coming up first. Are you kidding me? I was waiting that entire time, and then you go to war with them. You know what? If you weren't really good to me, I'd kill you off. Uh, and Zanzibar's at war. God dang it. I'm, oh, British aid and protectorate. That is disgusting. Oman? Uncivilized. Wait, why does... They own that too? What the heck? The Trucial States. Oh my goodness. Kuwait? I don't think I can get into Africa now at all. Oh, I can actually do this? Oh, that sounds like fun. Can I come here? Oh, I can do that. Maybe we can still get a colony here, maybe. I doubt it, but we'll see what happens. Uh, obviously we can't go there. Can't do that. Why? We need a bigger, more supply range, that's why. Kingdom of France. Ooh, can we get them down here? No, nope. god dang it. No naval base close enough. I have a naval base down here, though. Ugh, the god dang British. Uh, full citizenship. Absolutely. And honestly, just come back to home. Like, I was, I, we were ready to go. We went to war. We were ready to go. We're ready to fight. Give it our all. But you know what? The British got in the way. But I can't be too mad at them. They do win my wars for me. Look at that. So you have one infantry too much. You guys can come down there to Colon. You actually, the infantry can come down here. So we have one more infantry. So we're going to need another artillery. Actually, really, we're going to need... So you got one horse, yeah, one horse, and one artillery. Good. Awesome. Well, we're no longer at war. Tangier International Zone. Oh. Oh my god, that's disgusting. Britain, just give me something here. You're doing too much. You know what? Well, at least take Ivory Coast. Hopefully. Please. If I can't take this, if I can't take Windward Coast, give me that Ivory Coast. That's all I'm asking for. I'm not asking for a lot. Just another coast. Uh, no draft seems like a pretty bad idea, but whatever. When do we get this done? 1893. Alright, secularization first. Nope. 
that's the case. Budget-wise, we're doing pretty okay. It looks like, yep, pretty okay. More railroads. Awesome. Oh yeah, definitely put as much railroads as we possibly can around this area. Even a naval base would be good to do as well. Connect everyone together. Even at the expense of the budget, we are losing here, but that's okay because we can probably win right here. Oh, uh, 2-1? Why does it take that long? Where's that? I mean, yeah, we're, duh. I mean, I mean, okay, whatever. I don't really care. <laughs> Just don't let him colonize this. Yeah, we got more of this. That's good. Let's see, Germany. Uh, how about Portugal? What do they like? Oh, they like us. Well, I guess we are kind of related. Peru, we can increase relations with you. Chile. I might not kill you, be able to kill you now, but maybe eventually. Oh, can we go to war with you guys? Not yet. When is our truce done with them? 95, 95. So it's going to be a while. Hmm. Oh, we barely got enough support for that. Naval organization. Venezuela, pretty good. Nice, we're still allied. Cuba, Mexico. Eh, we can really increase relations with the Mexicans, that's fine. Seem like nice people. This could come in handy. Good, more rubber, I love it. I'm surprised no one else is taking a, trying to get Ivory Coast. Doesn't make any sense. Good. And we got you guys. Oh, what is that? Encourage the Amazon rubber boom. Oh, let's do that too. So, the rubber boom, or Ciclo da Boracha, was an important part of the economic and social history of Brazil and Amazonian regi regions of neighboring countries, being related to the extraction and commercialization of rubber. Centralized in the Amazon basin, the boom resulted in a large expansion of European colonization in the area, attracting immigrant workers, generating wealth, and causing cultural and social transformations. It encouraged the growth of cities such as Manaus, Porto Velho, and Belém, capitals within the respective Brazilian state of Amazonas, Rondônia, and Para. Obviously, I pronounced that really wrong. Oh my gosh, yes. 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 Search for the lost city of the Incas. I need Cusco. Huh. Uh, cool. So these two are, I, I didn't mention this yesterday, but these two are the same. Garcia Ortiz Mangabe Treaty. So they do the exact same thing. I don't know why it's in here twice, but we need mass politics in 1908 to get that treaty. Treaty of Petropolis, Petropolis. We need a lot of money. 1903, your mass politics. Rio Bronco. Huh. Oh, yeah, railroads. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Nice. Very good. Can I increase railroads down here too? Good, good, good. Open Earth Furnace. Not bad. We are doing really darn well now. I'm loving it. Uh, I guess we'll get more organization, supply range. Yeah, why not? That's not going to take that long. Look at that money. More money, more money. You guys are looking great. You guys are here. You three, come down here. Good. Now, are we still making that other... Yeah, we're making the Hussars. They take forever for some reason. There you are. Pretty easy, pretty quick. Gradually becoming more and more Brazilian, which we all love, 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 love. And what are the Dutch doing? Enter an alliance with the French. Alright, that's cool. Hey, look at that. Hmm. So we got the child labor legal. We got open... Oh, we can't do bankruptcy. Modern central banking system. That seems like a really good thing to do. Unlimited workday. 14 hour workday. Throughput goes down. More minimum wage. Safety regulations. Factory costs. Hmm. Trinket subsidies. I don't like that. I don't like that either. Oh, let's go with transportation, I guess. Capital punishment. Incarceration. So, transportation. Increase colonial migration, but also increase the necessity of bureaucrats. That's fine. Incarceration. Rehabilitation, yes. Uh oh. Minimum. Oh. Well, eh, maybe we can give them that soon enough. Give up your designs, paddle steamers. Yeah, I really neglected that. And eh, let's get high pressure steam engine yet. It's almost 20th century. We still haven't gotten those pressure systems yet. And there we go, come on. There you go. Look at that. 
Beautiful. We have our own African coast that we didn't have to kill anybody for. Weird. Very weird. Go ahead and pull out of here. That's fine with me. Organize every coast. Oh, we get five prestige. Nice. Awesome. Awesome. Use a tech squad. I never like doing that. I don't want to hurt my chances with anything. Get out of my lands. Actually, no. Stay in my lands in case there's rebellions. Wow, there's some weird ideologies right there. Hey, and they become that. Hey, you know what? At least we both worked it out. You guys want to kill each other, which is fine with me. Zen's... Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Maybe, finally, we can have a colony of our own. So, you're coming back. Am I making any more guys here? No. Oh, uh, no. Good. One, two, one, two. Wait. One, two, one, two. Okay, we'll make a fifth one, then. Sounds really great to me. Really, really great. Just don't get caught. Please don't get caught. For the love of God. Give me another piece of African territory, because Brazil can into Africa. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Yes, yes. Fight each other. Briz oh, the UK and the Netherlands. Temperance and labor. Let them work undisturbed. Yeah, I guess so. Why not? Uh, Netherlands, you're allied with France, but the UK is allied with me, too. Oh, that is not good. That is not good. But hey, infamy goes down actually by quite a bit in this mod, which is not bad for us. So, you know what? We'll deal with it. And by the time we're done with this... We're just going to go back to war with Argentina anyways, and probably save Scum to go to war with them without getting too much more infamy. Sounds like a good plan to me. Alright, come on back. Oh, wow, you guys... did you Do you not heal? Oh, maybe you need some more supplies. There you go. Let's do that first. Alright, so they are at 87% up here. With more supplies... Okay, that's good. That's good. Jeez, holy crap. Uh, yeah, go ahead and work your way over here, but oh, that is scary dangerous. Nice, build that up. More output. Compound steam engine, yes, yes. Farming output, awesome. Hmm. Maybe we'll build some railroads there. Maybe we can core South Madagascar eventually, because that would just... That would make us just amazing. Just, I don't know what to say, just amazing. Railroads, yes. Can we put more railroads here, too? Yes. Build it there for now, just because I can't afford it everywhere else. And they're still building, so. Oh, they entered in lines with Colombia. Ooh, look at this. Awesome, we can go to war immediately. But Italy, Monaco, Republic and Spain versus France, Austria, and other France? Dalmatia. Bukovina. Ooh, that is interesting. I guess we could play nice with these guys for now since they're allied with those guys. That's so be it, so be it. I'm so happy we got we actually have a piece of African territory. Um Zenzibar, we would love you. Go to war by May, June, about that time. That's a good idea. Hmm, I love it. Grain production, awesome. Ooh, incarceration, sure. How's the administrative place going? Uh, okay, well. You guys are still working. Oh, you definitely need railroads right there. You can go ahead and remove that for now. Put some administrative stuff right there. You guys are still working hard. Hard at work. Good. Brazilian kingdom. Hmm. My favorite kingdom. Ottoman Libya. Austria is not having a good time, but neither is Italy, so that's good. Ooh, they're not. Ooh, uh, Spain is not having a good time. That's awesome to see as well. Colonial exposition, a rousing cheer for the empire, or along with the captains of industry and technology. All pops in Rio. Ooh, research. I want more prestige. We can always get more research. By the end of the game, we'll have all the research done, hopefully. Ooh, you got some horsies there. One, two, three, four. One horse. Da, da, da. Good. You might as well build that up, too. Great. Ah, I love it. Steam turbine. Cultural stuff. Naval stuff. Obviously, we could have done better on that. Eh, do that one. Why not? Chamber of Commerce protests. 
more liberal. All capitals become more liberal. Uh, I'd rather have that than Uruguayans all become a little bit more liberal. Alright, so we got an army. We need to do this. We need to do this as well. It's going to hurt our budget a little bit. But if we do that, we should do relatively okay. Awesome. Oh, electric gears. Alright, we're going to give it a little bit more time. Empire Brazil, you need to become bigger. Let's see, where is the rubber? Right here. Do we have any place I could eat? Well, I mean, technically they could use it. So, oh yeah, help build them up right here. Maybe build one there, maybe build one... Is that oh, rubber down here, perhaps, as well? I don't have enough money for it, so there's that. Good, good, build ourselves up. And the army's pretty much ready, good to go. Come up here. Um, sure, Ashanti. That's fine with me, whatever. Can we get another guy? No, we cannot. If we're making that much money, go and stop taxing them as much. Good. And let's go to war. The Myster oh, what does that say? The mysterious lands of Guatemala. When the Gua Panama Canal was planned, several expeditions were sent into the regions of Central America. The inhabitants of the large jungles of Yucatan narrate stories of old cities and treasures. Adventurers and tomb raiders crossed and explored these remote areas and found ruins or steels. This news may be interesting for a Brazilian archaeologist. Give me my bully whip. Yes, yes, yes. Do we get any decisions for that? Search for no, 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 no. Not really. Nothing really new here, so... Good, good, good. And we must wait till the next month to lower the infamy just a little bit more. Ah, very good. That took quite a while to get through. That's okay. They are primitives. They have no military score, so I'm not too worried about this. Please give me my coast line. I mean, the, the you know, the Spanish and the English or British can fight over that stuff. I don't really care. I would just want Zanzibar. Great. How's this looking? Looking pretty uneventful. Roads, anyone? Awesome. Uh, oh, wow, we got a lot of consciousness. Yeah, whatever. We weren't getting immigrants anyways. But we are getting some more consciousness, which is great. Rehabilitation? Yes. More simulation rate. Maximize it as much as possible. Good. 1984. Open her furnaces. More output. More output, everyone. And is there anyone else we could go to war with? The Kingdom of France is right there. France. Belgian. Congo Free State. I don't think so. Darfur. Sounds like a great place to be. Ashanti is getting smacked down by these guys. So be it. Is anywhere else a Dutcher here? Oh. Adamawa. No, no, anyone named Adam right now, but that's... Uh, what the heck? UK. Oh, actually... Oh, no, man. My hand seems to be slipping here. I could get Vietnam. Do they have any good RGOs? They have rubber. Mm, do I get Vietnam? Screw it. We're going to get Vietnam. But we can lower our budget right now, probably. Give us a little bit more money, a little more cash. That'd be kind of nice. All right. So, we took him out. Great. That's really, really awesome. Get a naval base going. Maybe get some railroads. Shouldn't be too expensive doing that. Go ahead and stay right here. But that's pretty much where we're going to end today's episode. We've done really, really well. Like, holy cow. I did not think we... We, we went to war with Argentina early on. We will go to war with Paraguay probably in the next episode. As well as go back to war with Argentina and call in our allies to take more of their lands away, which will be a fun, fun thing. And, oh, what's going on there? We won the occupation, good. We had war happen to us, but we had a, I had a really good time. We got a little bit of African territory, we got even more African territory, and we are getting more and more educated. But I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you all tomorrow as we watch Europe hopefully burn. Thanks for watching, have a great rest of your day.